Hello everyone and welcome back to Xenoblade Chronicles X. Once again, Lin is like stepping inside of Tatsu. It's very disconcerting. Let's not look at it for too long. Uh, I have not done anything since last time I recorded. I actually got really caught up in a bunch of other stuff and didn't open this game because I got Super Mario Maker the other day and I've been spending most of my time playing Super Mario Maker. Because I'm a big fan of the Mario platforming games and Super Mario Maker is basically a dream come true for someone like me who just wants a bunch of levels to play and constantly have new levels to play. Even though I have to sift through all of the levels that constantly are just uh, where they play the game for you. Man, those levels get on my nerve. Uh, get on my nerve? My singular nerve. Not nerves, but just the one nerve that I have. What is this right here? I don't know why I'm just running around. But anyways, let me exit the scale and get whatever this is. This is like a high level mechanical I can do. Mechanical level three, don't mind if I do just steal this. Awesome. All right, so uh, this is being recorded before the videos on Thursday go up. It's Thursday as I'm recording this. It's about two hours until those videos start getting uploaded. Let's talk to whoever is over here really fast. But anyways, my point in saying that is um, if people have been telling me, which they probably have, if people have been telling me about the um, how the scale works and how the arts work. Uh, I actually looked it up myself and haven't seen any comments yet. So if there is something you've told me in the comments on the last four videos that I don't mention in this one, it's because I haven't seen those comments yet because they do not yet exist in my timeline. That's right, you're in a different timeline now. Congratulations. But anyway, so I have looked up some stuff. I have a general understanding. I know how to get arts on my scale. I have to go buy parts for it that like give it shoulder weaponry and weaponry on the back and stuff like that. So I know how to do that. Uh, hopefully there is some other cool stuff that people have told me in the comments that I can add on to my knowledge next time I record. Anyways, hey there, can I ask your help with something? It's wonderful that we've begun living with the Manon, truly it is, but as you probably know, any sudden surge in population brings with it certain problems. Start ranting about how the Manon are so annoying and wishy-washy. Ask Oja if she's talking about food shortage. Probably food so shortage. Shortage? I can't talk, man. That will likely be a problem at some point, yes, but it's rather outside of my area of expertise. I speak of something we just need, we need just as much as food, perhaps even more. Water. New LA is looking at a huge shortage of clean, potable water. We're trying to build a purification plant on a lake outside the city, but indigents are preventing us from transporting materials to the site. Might I convince you to secure the route for us? Once we can ship in the necessary materials, the project shouldn't take long at all. Uh, I'm pretty sure the human body can go longer without food than it can without water. Isn't it like, uh, you can go, like two or three weeks without food, but you can only go a week without water? I think. I think that's right. Maybe it's only a few days without water. I can't remember. I know that you need water more than you need food. I know that at least. But anyways, defeat five stagnant Grexes. Yeah, I can do that. That's an easy mission. I should not have set that as my navigation target. You know what, actually, yeah, let's do this as our navigation target, then we'll go do the other thing. First, we're gonna go to the, uh, where's my Wii U pad? There it is. All right, first we're gonna go and buy uh, more parts for this skell so that this skell can uh, help us fight. Gotta go to Armory Alley, I assume is where I get it from. Gonna get some arts on this skell. Cannot wait to battle with the skeleton when it actually has arts to use. Alright. Can only imagine how many people were ticked off at me for uh, not doing that immediately after getting my skell. Alright. Can I buy skell stuff here? Yes, I can. I can get gear. Gear is what I need in frames. Purchase skells, like skells themselves. Holy crap, skells are expensive. Look at that. That's six digits. Oh, I have seven digits of money right now. Just barely, though. But I can buy more skills. Very, very, very good to know. Oh, that one, that's a heavy class. Yeah, it's a heavy type. There are three different types, I remember. Heavy, medium, and then light. Yeah. That's a uh, really, really good. I'll probably get one of each. Like a medium type for... Medium type for Elma, light type for me, and heavy type for uh, Lynn, I guess? Anyways, it says that I can't buy these, though. They're in, like, red. You won't be able to register this scale at your current level. Proceed anyways. Oh, you have to have a certain level? What's the level? Oh, the frame level is 30. Are all of these 30? Ah, they're all 30. Okay, cool. So I just have to get level 30, and then I can buy a bunch of scales. So can everyone have their own scale, or does this just, like, replace my other scale? I assume that everyone can have their own scale. I don't see why not. Oh, that one looks really cool. I might end up buying a scale just based on if I think it looks cool or not. 
That is not a good way to look about it. Anyways, these all look pretty awesome. I'm reading some of the stats. I like the look of this Inferno one. What is the Lila? Oh, Lila from uh, Tales of Graces. Pretty good, pretty good. What does Mastema look like? Come on, load up, come on. That's pretty cool. We'll look more into those later. I need to look up specific... I didn't look that up. I just looked up how to get arts on them. I need to look up if you can... Uh, I'm probably going to record the next session before this goes up, so people will probably tell me beforehand. But I'm going to look up if I can have a skeleton on everyone. I think I can. I'm not positive, though. Skell gear is what I really need, though. Yeah, here's the one I have now. I need gear on this guy. So I'm pretty sure I need, like, these back weapons and stuff. And this will give me arts. I think. I believe that's how it works. It's a rail gun. All right. Then we've got the uh, S missile. And then we've got the laser gun. Ooh, I like lasers. That's physical. The rest are thermal. I think I want this one. The, uh, the missile one. I'm not sure, though. I'm trying to decide which one is best. Four ammo sets, 360 times four, 720... 1080 then 14 1440 or something like that I think this one is better the top one yeah the top one costs more so it makes sense Are these level 30 stuff yeah it is I think I'm gonna go with this cheaper one then I also want a right back weapon to have something the same thing actually would be nice. I'm going to buy some relatively cheap stuff because I don't plan on keeping this stuff for long. Once I get to level 30, I'm going to do a massive overhaul on the scales. Uh, if I have scales for everyone by then, then for everyone's scales. So I need to keep money for them for that. So I want to buy relatively cheap stuff just to work with for now. In fact, I might just stop there. Could get another right arm weapon. Could get some shields. Ooh. That's pretty good. Does that just like lessen the damage I take, or it ups my evasion, if nothing else. <laughs> Not entirely sure what they do. Do they just give me some kind of an art, like a spare art that helps? Beam Saber. Ooh. Ooh. I like these. I like these a lot. Yeah, this is all pretty cool stuff. And what's down here? Is this, like, the armor pieces that I can have on it? It just like up its yeah ups defense and stuff like that and resistances and all okay i think for now i'm just gonna stick with the two things i have because when i get to level 30 i want to i want to get to level 30 and then buy better stuff you know what i mean so for now we're just gonna stick with what we have now we should have the uh where's my scale scale where did you go oh there it is it wasn't spawned in i guess all right so now we should i'm pretty sure that the way that these shoulder or back weapons i got work is that they're basically they give me arts that activate them uh there's someone i need to talk to right there apparently what do i need to talk to this person for hey uh alice what are why do you exist can i help you non-disclosure agreements keep me from discussing work but i'm happy to speak on anything else probably uh oh this is the person i have to get her measurements for uh yeah i need your measurements you want measurements of my body's physical dimensions, yes? As it turns out, all my biometrics were taken when I started working at my current job. You're welcome to a copy of that data if you want. I want to ask what you aim to do with these numbers, okay? All right, yes, I will. Wonder where, you say? Wonder where? This is some new manner of weapon, perhaps. It sounds so, so deadly. I don't know the specifics, but, 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 I wish you luck in your R&D efforts. All right, cool. That's one person down. We'll worry about the rest of that later. Let's go defeat these Grexes with the new and improved Skell, now that we have these back weapons. All right, uh, what am I doing? I need to use fast travel. I was about to go to my missions, but I've already got it set. So we're going to kill these stagnant Grexes real fast. Oh, cool. They're not too far. And after we do that, we'll go and... Affinity mission. We have to finish the affinity mission we're doing. And then we have that level 24 affinity mission that I wanted to do. And after that... I think we'll have finished all the affinity missions that we could do for the moment. If I'm not mistaken. Alright, let's go. Oh, they're right here. Well, this makes things really convenient. They're very high-leveled. Not very high-leveled. They're like level 20. I was expecting them to be lower-leveled than this. 
Whatever. Let's start killing them. Yep, I got arts, finally. All right, target single enemy, 30 fuel, deals thermal damage, topple target is boosted. Take this. Take another. Oh yeah, that's cool. See, now this, this is a lot better. This is gonna let my, uh, this is going to let my, um, Skell do way better in the field. What is that noise? Are we fighting four at once right now? <laughs> this is gonna get a little intense. Die, do they have the thing where they like level up to green? No, they don't get the uh, afterburner thing. Burn, you foolish Grexes, that's one down. What the heck, what happened? Why am I inside the, I was like, I was looking from the cockpit perspective. What the heck was that? That was confusing. Die, you stupid Grex, die. Oh, someone went down. Oh, Gwyn did, because he's like level 12. <laughs> Whatever, I don't even need Gwyn. I can win without him. I forgot we had Gwyn on the team, actually. Die, you Grex. All right, yeah, being able to equip this other stuff, and now I really like using the scale. In fact, using the scale is awesome now. I just need to get more arts on it. Which we will do once I get to level 30. I'm in this again. I don't understand how this works. What does this mean? Does it just let me reuse my arts really fast? It looks like it auto, like, turned them back on. Kind of liking the scale music. Like, the battle music is different when you're in a scale. I like it so far. Die, you stagnant Grex. I'm about to get my uh, overdrive. I'll probably save it, though. I'm not going to use it in this fight. Time to die. Get out of here. Yeah, the whole Mr. Barrage thing is pretty cool. It's time for overdrive. Die, I say. Is it like making it go faster than normal? Like it does when I'm in normal form and I go into overdrive? Can't tell. It's going pretty slow, but maybe that's just how long it takes. Die, Grex, die. There we go. Why is everything, it's because I'm in overdrive. I was about to say, why is everything like blurred out on the edges? It's because I'm in overdrive right now. Die, Grex. There we go. Easy kills. All right, now there should just be one left. Hey buddy, how's it going? I'm sorry, but I have to murder you. It's the only way. You must die. I apologize that it has to be this way. Oh, I'm in this thing again. Yeah, I think it just reactivates my arts, it looks like. I don't know what triggers that, though. I don't know how I, like, trigger it. Is this all you got, you stupid stagnant Grex? Like, you're, you're nothing, man. What a pushover. Die. Yeah, this will be a lot better when I have more than just the two arts to work with. There we go. All right, we'll talk to Keith later. I don't really care to right now. Let's go and do the nine lives. Let's finish that up. All right, uh, is it faster for me to fast travel? Uh, yes it is, because it's on the other side of Primordia. <laughs> yeah, it's way on over there. Uh, this should be pretty close. We were at the west of NLA. We need to be at the east to go to the Cliffside Beach or whatever it's called. All right then. We'll get there in no time with the almighty uh, car form. It is so convenient to be able to move so fast. I love it. All right, the kitty should be around here somewhere. Am I gonna get a cutscene? It looks like I'm getting a cutscene. Wasn't there a guy over here that, yep, there he is. Is that the kitty? Hold on, Matthias, we're coming. It's just one Grex, what a pushover. Am I still in my scale? Yeah, I am. A Shallows Grex at level 20? Easy pickings. Get out of here. Oh, hey, I'm back in the uh, cockpit again. I still don't understand what causes that, but whatever. This Grex is already almost dead. Get toppled. Yeah, I can't do that right now because I'm currently in my scale, so I'll be sure to do that later on. Did you see that jump? That was a pretty impressive jump. I got to give the Grex props there. As soon as this charges up, yep, you're dead. Oh, wow, you... Oh, no, it didn't. I thought it lived for a second there, but it didn't. 